Namaste, my friend. Happy Jack here. Welcome to day three of Win Your Day. And today is all about high vibe nutrition. Nutrition is everything. You know, for those who know me well, you know that I lost 100 pounds. There was a time I was over 250 pounds. And as I was, you know, working to lose that weight, initially I was you know, going to the gym and moving my body, and, and that was, of course, good. However, when I dialed in my nutrition, the weight started to just fall off. And that is, and not that your goal necessarily is lose weight, maybe it is. However, it's about energy. For me now, I want optimum health, I want longevity, I want energy. High vibe nutrition is where it's at. So what does that mean for me? Living foods, salads, green juices, like plant-based, Whole Foods is where it's at. I mean, in fact, busted right now, maybe you can see, I got turmeric on my hands, made an amazing green juice this morning. I uh, haven't had time to properly wash my hands apparently, but I'll tell you what, it shifts everything. I'll just let you in right now. I was gonna postpone recording this video today because I was, you know, I woke up, I was feeling kind of tired and low energy and I was like, uh, I'll wait until tomorrow because tomorrow I'm gonna feel better, I thought. And then I had my green juice and boom, I, all of a sudden I had like incredible energy and I was like, no, we're on, this is it. So because of high vibe nutrition, this video got, got recorded right here, right now. And that's what's possible for you. Think about it. What's most important for you to get done in your life? You made your decisions on day one, right? Of when your day, what are your priorities for the day, for the week? And when you fuel your body with nutrition that's gonna lift you up, give you vitality, give you energy, I mean, there's nothing that beats that. So, another few considerations to keep in mind. You know, I'm not gonna tell you exactly what to eat, although you wanna shoot questions, happy to share. There's this whole concept around intermittent fasting. And really, I mean, everybody fasts to some extent. When you sleep, you are fasting. You're not eating, right? And then you wake up, you have breakfast, breakfast, break the fast. So really think about how much time between your last meal in the evening until your breakfast, your first meal of the next day. And as you extend that out, it's really just giving your digestive system a break, right? A, a well-deserved rest. If you've ever done a juice cleanse, if you've ever done a, a juice, you know, really a, a fast like that, that's what you're doing. You're giving your digestive system a break. So what I really practice I do is three hours before bed, no food. So that means I go to bed at 9 p.m. each night. My thing, right, I'm bed at nine, up the next day at 5 a.m. So that means at 6 p.m. is when I have dinner, right? I don't do an 8 p.m. dinner and then go to bed at nine. If you've ever done that, which I'm sure you have, it impacts your sleep, it impacts the quality of your sleep, you know, it can give you some funny dreams, not that that's a bad thing, but really you just, you don't get the rest that you deserve because your body is digesting, it's working all night long. So rule of thumb, three hours, again, that's, that's just what works for me. You try it out, what works for you. My invitation, choose some high vibe foods, green juice, salads, like all these kinds of things that just like raise the vibrations Decide when you're gonna have your last meal each day for the rest of this five day challenge. When is your last meal gonna be? When is your breakfast gonna be? Right, so my dinner's at 6 p.m. Then the next day I'm up at five, do my training, and I have breakfast, my protein and green shake at 7 a.m. So I'm having a 13 hour fast, perfect. Right, if you wanna get into juice cleansing, you're welcome to, to learn more about that. I'm, I love sharing about that. And the last thing I'm gonna leave you with is cleansing. So I'm not gonna teach it, it's not part of this program. This is advanced. This is an advanced curriculum with something I'm passionate about. And that is on a weekly basis, on a monthly basis I do a, a colon hydrotherapy. However, even right here at home, on a weekly basis I do an enema and also a wheatgrass implant. And this is something that's been around for thousands of years. The Egyptians were doing it, it's so cleansing, it's hydrating, and the wheatgrass implant is so alkalizing. I'm not gonna go into detail of what that's about. Uh, if you wanna learn more, Google it, ask questions. 
But most importantly, your invitation, your homework, your home assignment for today is to make some decisions. What is the high vibe nutrition that you are choosing for the rest of the week that's gonna lift you up so you get stuff done like I just did today. I recorded this video because I put some turmeric, I put some green juice into my body. So decide, commit, and then you get to enjoy. Tag us, Happy Jack Yoga, throw up a post, throw up a story so we can share it, so we can hold you accountable. We are in this together. We are a high vibe tribe. Make it an amazing day three and stay tuned. We got some more magic coming for you tomorrow. Make it an amazing day, my friend. Namaste. Namaste, my friend. Happy Jack here. I trust you enjoyed this video and here's the deal. If you would love to learn how our high vibe tribe can support you and empower you in deepening your yoga practice and really winning your day, click the link below. Enter your name, enter your email, and we will share with you how our high vibe tribe is gonna empower you in taking it to your next level. We'll see you on the inside. Namaste, my friend.